What's up dudes, it's your bestest buddy in the whole freaking galaxy, Urban Blaster, playing some Star Wars Galaxy of Heroes, it's that free to play mobile game because I don't pay for this shit, and uh, it's another uh, meta breakdown, we're going to do another meta overview, if you're not familiar with the meta, it is uh, out on uh, Swagagaga, that's S-W-G-O-H dot G-G, they uh, have a report of the uh, top... Uh, teams, top uh, leaders, top dudes being used by the the top dudes on all the shards. And um, today we're going to be looking at the uh, Rex meta. He's uh, leading, he's uh, next to Maul. He's like the second top uh, leader being used out on there. And we're going to uh, see uh, why. We're going to break down that team. That's the team that I run. But let's uh, take a look at that wizard crew. Here's a story of a man named Rexy. He was kicking ass and taking names. He ran into these other dudes and they somehow formed this group. And that's how they became the Meta Bunch. The Meta Bunch. The Meta Bunch. Kicking ass, it's the Meta Bunch. Okay, enough of that uh, tomfoolery. Here we are. Um. It's the Meta Bunch, Rexy lead. Um, these uh, dudes all around him are uh, some of the top dudes. You'll see him rolling within the uh, top uh, dudes out on uh, in the uh, top um, PvP arena. But uh, let's uh, take a look at Rex and why he's such a good leader. He's that light side clone uh, trooper support. He's um, his leadership skills uh, brings turn meter and health gains. He could be farmed in the fleet and guild shops. He has his uh, basic, it's the impeding shot. This thing deals damage to a target enemy and removes 25% turn meter. So that's pretty good, taking away some turn meter, which also makes him a great uh, in the rank core raids. And then he has a special, the squad discipline. This thing dispels all negative status effects on all allies and grants them tenacity up for three turns. Clone allies gain 60% turn meter plus an additional 10% turn meter for each effect dispelled this way. And other allies gain half that amount. Bam! So he's taking the uh, red above your head, putting up some green with that tenacity up. And uh, that tenacity up's no joke. That's uh, the best thing that I like about this dude. Along with that, he's uh, bumping up everybody on the crew with them. Um, uh, it looks like a 30% turn meter because most of the dudes are not clones. And an additional 5% uh, turn meter because it is half of that if they're not clone dudes. But that's uh, pretty wicked right there. I love that move. And then he has his subdue. That's another special. This thing deals physical damage to a target enemy plus bonus damage equal to 20%. 25% of the target's max health. Bam! He's uh, taken down that green, whittling you down with that move. And then he has his leadership skills. This is when clone allies gain 20% max health and other allies gain half that amount. So you'll be seeing a 10% max health bump up. In addition, whenever any ally suffers a critical hit, all clone allies gain 15% turn meter and other allies gain half that amount. Bam! So you're going to be getting some uh, about 7% turn meter gains from this uh, dude. Actually, 7.5% turn meter gains to be exact whenever... Uh, they get uh, any of your dudes take a critical hit. Okay, and here's the uh, top teams that you'll uh, see in the meta report. Let's uh, kind of give a overview breakdown of uh, the synergies between them, which you'll see uh, happening. So you got your uh, Rex lead, who's going to be bringing those 7.5% turn meter gains whenever any of your allies are critically hit and then he also bumps up uh, your max health to uh, 10% because we won't be running with any uh, clones but the uh, team on the far left it's Ken General Kenobi, Baze Malbus, Cheru Inway and Darth Nihilus that's a hard team to deal with and why? because you got General Kenobi he's just a, a beast, he's a tank, he uh, starts taking the, the heat off the team he's a uh, uh, deep uh, heat dispels so uh, along with Rex and Chirrut there you got three dispellers going on the with Rex is dispel he takes the red off your team's head turns it into a tenacity up so that's gonna just cripple uh, any of those dudes with some um, 
who bring the red over your head like Zader or um, uh, Darth Sidious um, and then there's uh, Baze Malbus um, he's thick, he's a tank, he's gonna start off taunting he's gonna take the heat off your team right away he uh, also uh, takes the uh, green off the enemy's head flips it to red on one of his specials then you got Chirrut he uh, He's a dispeller, but when he dispels, he uh, takes the red off your team's head, but also gives you heal heal over time for a, a few turns. Then you got Darth Nihilus. He's that dude who uh, messes with the uh, your enemy's uh, cooldowns, takes him away, and then he has that one hit kill, so he could take out anybody on the team when you get that um, uh, special all uh, ready to be used. Then the next team is uh, Kylo Ren with the Chase and Darth Nihilus. The difference here is you got Kylo Ren, most likely with the Zeta, because you don't want to run Kylo without that Zeta. And uh, what his Zeta does is it, anytime he does his uh, outrage, he uh, pretty much wrecks a dude, possibly stunning him, but also as much uh, damage as he does, it puts that much more protection back on him, so he's just a, a beast, and uh, anytime he takes uh, damage, it takes down all the cooldowns on him so that outrage could be used over and over again as long as he's taking damage so those two teams on the far left are the top two uh, teams being used with the Rex lead in the meta this middle team is my team it's not in the meta but it's a hard-hitting team um, with the wigs you get that uh, triple molly wop action from uh, Biggs and Wedge calling in, an, uh, in, an, in another assist and then uh, there's just a hard hitting team I run it because I am uh, mostly free to play and I don't really have Chase and uh, uh, ready as you can see these uh, screenshots of players are my actual players so I can't run Kenobi right now I can't run Baze or Truth they're not ready but I can run Darth Nihilus and I can run all the rest of the dudes and then the last two teams that are um, out there on the metas these are the next uh, most two popular teams with the Rex lead you got your General Kenobi lead you got your Boba Fett who uh, does uh, takes away their abilities with his AOE. He uh, has the Bounty Hunter's Resolve, which uh, brings him back to life. He ignores taunts. He can knock the taunts off the tank's heads. He's a wicked uh, dude out there for support. And then the only two difference between these two teams is Kylo Ren and Emperor Palpatine, and that would be Zylo, and we went over him. But then uh, Emperor Palpatine, he is a great support dude. He's going to stun the whole team, take away turns, just screw them up. He could uh, put offense over, offense up over the whole team. He's just a really good support character. But that's um, sort of a breakdown of what you'll see with these uh, teams that are being ran out there with the Rex lead. My team uh, is in the center. I'd love to be able to run the Chase uh, team, but they're not ready. General Kenobi, they're all works in progress, but we'll uh, have them ready one day. But uh, let's go put so together some of these teams and uh, frickin' uh, see where we get on the uh, arena. Okay, dudes, uh, let's go out to the squad arena the, uh, and uh, see where we're at. Today, I'm uh, right now I'm ranked 64. Not bad. I don't get bumped back that much. When I did start running this Rex uh, crew, I did... Uh, was able to get into the top 50 pretty much pa uh, cash out there every day and I don't get bumped back as far um, but in my opinion it, he does his uh, this team does work best against dark side teams and why because they uh, bring those reds you kind of pretty much render their team uh, useless and uh, we'll go up against this uh, Dark Nihilus uh, led team power level 4600 my power level is 4200 I know you can't see that because my uh, frickin noggins in the way but I'm at only 4200 power they're at um 4600 but let's do this we want that 57 spot um, so as I was showing I, I would love to run uh, the chase with this crew and uh, I could run Nihilus and Boba Fett and make a combo of those uh, teams but the, t the the dudes that I am working on is uh, Chase to replace uh, uh, Wiggs 
and then also I am working on General Kenobi. I do have him at five stars, but that's why I'm not. Uh, that's why I'm running this team. But it, I just want to show you that you could uh, put a lot of different combos together with them. Um, Rex, even though this isn't a meta team, but let's do this. Okay, dudes, uh, we got the speed, so we'll be doing some AoEs from Wedge and Tilly's. And they're running primarily Siths. The great thing about this team is, uh, uh, against a Sidious or a Vader is they'll put the dots or uh, Sidious will put those exposes but once we get that uh, tenacity up from uh, Rex we pretty much render this team useless so right now I'll dispel put the tenacity above our heads that pretty much rendered uh, Sidious and uh, um, Vader useless and we'll just uh, go after this uh, well, we'll stun the whole team while we attempt to frickety frack, man. Okay, and Nihilus probably didn't get much uh, on that um, steal because we had the tenacity up. See, as you can see, we resisted all of Vader's uh, dots, so uh, that's the great thing about uh, the tenacity up. It just frickin' renders these uh, dudes useless. You do have to worry about... Uh, Death Trooper along with um, B-52 Super Battle Dork because he does dispel and puts the uh, what's it called the uh, buff immunity so then you can't get back the tenacity up but as you can see we're uh, whittling down this team but they're not doing much to us we'll put this dude out of his misery he won't be taunting again BAM okay now we'll uh, just get rid of Sidious or Palpatine we don't want him stunning our team because that does affect us pretty good because if you can't uh, put that tenacity up or dispel then he's rendering you useless okay they're targeting my Palpatine I do have Xylo so once I uh, take out Palpatine I'll get my protection 100% back BAM <laughs> frickin A man that's why you need some uh, well uh, bump down his turn meters on Nihilus and we'll go after uh... I'm not worried about Nihilus or Vader they're pretty uh... useless against this team but uh... Dooku he could get that expose off on us with that AOE of his because we don't have that tenacity up anymore and a few... oh they took out Palpatine but no worries dudes we'll take out C uh, Sidious right now oh close he didn't even try to get that AOE off on us I don't know what's going on with... oh crap maybe I'm speaking too much gotta focus but we do have um, Kylo we will get a hundred percent protection again BAM now we'll uh, put back the tenacity up and we'll uh, just go after uh, Nihilus right now he is the lead so they do have a lot of uh, pr uh, health gains right now because they turn their health into pr their protection into health all the sifts and uh, one thing about Rex he is kinda squishy BAM we stun Nihilus he won't be getting off that one hit thing we'll uh, double molly whop him we lost uh, Wedge now we'll uh, get our protection back hopefully stun him again and uh, Nihilus is almost done there he goes okay now we'll um, go after Vader he is pretty powerful so we'll uh, hopefully get through him I mean he just has a lot of health that's he's not super powerful but we we'll, might stun him here BAM and we'll uh, just do go with the heavy hits on him Kylo should end it now BAM VICTORY Okay, dude, so uh, who's our next victim? Should it be this um, Zeta team? I'm guessing he's uh, has the Zeta because uh, why else would you run him as your leader? And yeah, he does. But the thing to watch out for is this uh, with Zeta is uh, if you got a faster Rex, then you're going to render this dude useless. He's a speed of 189. Let's see what I could... Uh, 
or maybe I could stun him with Palpatine. I can't remember my dude speeds. That's why I'm bad at this. But uh, let's take on this Zader team. They they are running Rex. We don't do too much uh, debuffs on our team, so we'll we'll just uh, go against this dude. Let's see what we if we could take this 49 spot. Okay, here's this wicked team. We'll uh, should we switch out some dudes? Should we run? Um, uh, we'll go. Yeah, let's uh, do another team from the mat. I don't know if it's going to work out, but there's a Boba Fett and Darth Nihilus. Frickin' A, man. Okay, there's that uh, Wicked uh, Sif right there. So we're going to be running with Wet Rex lead. Emperor Palpatine for his support. He's that walking taser. We got Boba Fett. He'll be jetpacking with some AoEs taking away their abilities. We got Xylo Ren. Uh, he's a one, hit, one uh, man crew all by himself. And then we got um, Darth Nihilus. We'll uh, see if we can get that one hit kill off. Okay, dudes, here we are. They got the speed, but we're, we're not scared. They chose not to, do, to put their tenacity up, so we were faster than uh, their Vader, Zader, so he'll we'll render, render him useless right there. Bam! That's the great thing about um, Rex. I'm telling you that tenacity up is the best thing about him. So now we'll try to take away some turns, stun these fools, we stun uh, Palpatine, so that's good, so he can't stun us. Now we'll uh, just whittle down this sh this uh, short trooper. We They got a lot of red above their heads, so we'll steal some souls. So hopefully uh, get that one hit kill going soon. Okay, now we'll knock that taunt right off his head. That's why Boba Fett's uh, wicked. And another thing that I like to do run with this team sometimes too is frick I shouldn't have one after him. Oh well, we'll try to stun Palpatine so he doesn't get that AOE off. Bam! <laughs> and that's the great thing about uh, Kylo Xylo Ren is he uh, gains protection when he does his um, second special, and uh, he could stun with it. So now we'll uh, should we bump up our offenses? Yeah, let's bump up our offenses so we could uh, hit harder. And with that, uh, as you can see, uh, we do have the tenacity up. Most of the team uh, withstood that those dots from Zader, because they he is Zader, so uh, he will uh, keep bringing those back. Those dots will keep coming back. Nihilus did get affected, but no worries. Okay, they got their taunting going on again, but we'll, uh, frick, man, this team's kicking ass. This is why I run with wigs, because they just annihilate these dudes. Now we'll, uh, bump up our, uh, healths again. Our protection, I mean, full protection. On, oh, that was Kylo who got the, uh, damn, we lost Rexy. This isn't going too good, but we can knock the, the taunt off this dude's head with Nihilus. And now we'll put him to hopefully put him to rest with the uh, bam. Okay. Um, so those dots above Kylo, not uh, Nihilus. And so that's kind of good because Nihilus wouldn't be able to take that with the Xylo. We'll keep getting our uh, protection back. Boba Fett's going to just come back. He'll uh, let's take out uh, Palpatine. Hopefully we take him out. Gain. Oh, and we did. We got our uh, bounty hunter's resolve back. We'll get back our protection from um, here. Xylo, bam, 100% protection again. We'll try to stun these dudes with Palpatine. AOE these fools. Now we'll uh, we'll uh, just go after Rexy. We won't steal any souls at this time because we're just one turn away from the one hit wonder. We'll take away some abilities. Jetpack in. And now we'll. Uh, knock uh, Rex out of the picture. Now we'll uh, go after t TIE Fighter Pilot. Damn, we didn't stun him, so he could... Uh... 
Yeah, we'll, uh, we'll just hopefully get the bonus attack. And we did, uh, frick, they got the, uh, bam, we'll hit one hit. Damn it, we don't have Rex out there to frickin' keep us from Zader. But if we could get a turn from, uh, Nihilus, we'll one hit kill this dude. Boba Fett will come back, we'll hopefully stun him. Oh, he wrecked his world, victory! As you can see, we only lost one dude, it was getting hairy at the end. Bam, we're in the top 50. Okay, dudes, one last battle. Going to try to take the 44th uh, spot. It is a uh, Darth Maul lead. He's probably Zated. And his leadership is Max. So, yep, he is Zeta. Um, but let's do this. Do we want to run this team again? I don't know. I, I kind of prefer my Wiggs team. Boba Fett's a beast. And so is Darth Nihilus. But I do... Uh, I am really enjoying the Wigs uh, tag team duo still, um, but let's do this. And you will see that the uh, tenacity up will uh, render this dude useless. So he did get off his uh, advantage thingy. So I mean, uh, advantage exposed. So we are all exposed if we could uh, stun these dudes didn't take any more damage we pretty much uh, took away that exposed r rendered it useless so pretty much that was a waste of a move right there but either way if we got that tenacity up none of them would have stuck so either way that uh, frickin uh, dude in a bathrobe who comes to war far hideous is rendered useless by this team so now we'll uh, just bump up our uh, offense hit even harder now uh, we could go after, oh, Sidious is, they're all stealthed except for Sidious, so we'll just uh, take him out. AoEs from Wedge and Tilly's. Got those counters from Counter Dooku, but he's no, uh, he's not uh, any threat to us. Bam, <laughs> we got rid of uh, Barf Hideous. He was a, a useless pleb on this team with this Rex lead. Now we'll go after Maul. I don't want to go after Dooku yet because I hate those counters. So now we'll try to take away Darth Nihilus's turn so he doesn't mess with our uh, cooldowns. We didn't get that uh, turn meter downs to stick. Oh well. Now we'll go after counter Dooku. We'll stun Darth Vader. We don't have any lost protection so no worries there. Um... Now we'll uh, go after Dooku. I just don't like that dude. Oh, he deflected it again. Frick. Okay, now Vader, he's the only one not stealthing. That's the, the, these battles do take a little bit, but as you saw, we, we resisted all the uh, dots except for Kylo. His, t his t uh, tenacity must be really uh, low because he, he never resists those. Oh, well. It's no threat. Now that they're all stealthed, we could go after uh, Maul, get rid of him, get our protection back. Oh, these dodges that Maul brings. Now we got our cooldowns screwed up because of Nihilus. We'll uh, go after Maul, they're all stealthed, and we'll put him out of his misery. Oh, he dodged that. He got that freaking daze off, but we'll. Uh, get rid of him bam now we'll uh hopefully they don't take out Rexy before we could get a we'll stun uh Dooku bam and we didn't stun him but we did wreck him now we'll uh get him out of the picture crap we didn't get the triple or double that's weird I know we wouldn't get the triple but Rex was out there but oh but he has the days so we're frick man Oh well, we got rid of Maul, he won't be dazing us anymore. Now we'll uh, take the red above our heads, now they're dead. I mean, it's all over now. We, As long as these dodges don't freaking happen, and we might time out. But let's uh, get heal up Palpatine, which also... Uh, frick. Okay, we'll get rid of Vader. 
triple molly wop nihilus oh shoot he has a bunch of protection okay we got rid of vader we'll just auto play the rest on 4x the time's whittling down He might get off a one hit kill, but I don't think so. Shit, these dodges. Victory! And we did it. That's how you take out the uh, mall teams. <laughs> Victory! Okay, dudes, you just saw that uh, meta team uh, breakdown. Um, I love the uh, Rex lead. It did take me from the uh, top 100 to the top 50, and I could actually hold in there. Um, it does, it's not every day, I mean, sometimes, I'll, I mean, I pretty much 98% uh, of the time catch out in the top 50, some days, you know, if there's a lot of activity, I might get bumped down, but no worries, I do love that Rex lead, he does bring that tenacity up, that's my favorite part of it, it pretty much renders a lot of those di dark side uh, teams useless, and um, he is a bit squishy though. And then uh, the rest of his uh, supporting crew, you saw the uh, what the, the top dudes are running. I highly suggest those. Mix match, I mean, I throw in wigs in there just because they hit hard. And they um, just fucking wreck some fools. But I hope you guys enjoyed this video, another meta breakdown. And if you want to stay tuned, there is a defeat that I went through. It is why only, it proves why I only go against dark side teams with this team. Light side teams are a little bit challenging, but I'll see you in the next one. Okay, dudes, here we are. Gonna try to take the, uh, number 42 spot. Um, I try to avoid the, uh, light side teams with, uh, this Rex lead. But uh, let's uh, see what we could do. I'm just uh, curious if I'm going to win this. This might be a mistake. We might not get that victory. But I'm debating whether or not to run the uh, wigs. Because as you saw, that last battle did stretch out. Because without the uh, big hits from uh, the tag team duo of uh, Wedge and uh, Big's Dark Lighter, we, it does take drag on a bit. But let's do this. Let's keep the same team. Mostly Dark Side going against these uh, light side crap we do have that b2 super battle dork out there which wigs is really good at taking out super quick they got the speed but they went after boba fett that was their biggest mistake so now we'll uh whittle down um base the bus malbus that dude's thick as freaking canadian bacon but we'll uh dispel we'll debuff our team, or we'll dispel our team. We'll try to stun these fools. We did. So now we'll uh, just try to whittle down uh, Baze some more. Bam! Now we'll uh, put wreck his world with the uh, execute. He has a bunch of uh, squares. Oh! But no worries. Boba Fett comes back. We got uh, Nihilus, so we'll knock that taunt off his head again. He did get those health gains from True. That's why I freaking hate this team. Okay, so now we'll uh we'll try to get a uh, wedge out of the scene. Take away his, some turn meter from him. Damn it, we need Boba to get a kill. Um, it's not gonna happen, but we'll uh AOE's taking away their abilities. Shit, they triple molly whopped Rex. They're wrecking us. This is why I don't try not to run this team against light side. Because, like I said, that tenacity up really has no... Doesn't do much against this team. Uh, against those dark side sit teams, it does render them useless. And this was a big uh, mistake. So now we'll just... Uh, try to... Win gracefully. I mean, lose gracefully. Make hopefully they make it quick, but we do got Zylo, so I'm not um, counting us out yet. He is a one-man wrecking crew. Shit, we can't go after uh, frickin' Bays, man. He's thick as Canadian bacon. I think the 
Canadian bacon stick? I don't frickin' know. He's just a frickin' beast of a bus. Okay. He is fun to one-hit kill with the uh, Nihilus. It doesn't look like we're gonna do it. That sucked. 